Welcome back to Dead Space. We need to go destroy what I think is the last tendril in Chief Steward's office, and then the marker should be untethered. Then I think we can ditch it? Put it back on the planet? I don't know, we're gonna do something with it. and you'll kill us all. When they took the marker from each of seven, it went to being in the core of the planet. The hell is that? Mercer calls it the hive mind. Nexus organism, which controls these necromorphs telepathically. If we leave while the hive mind is active, well, you saw the power. If even a single necromorph escapes, humanity is finished. The marker. Amelia, she knew. She told me it would return the beast to its slumber. Okay. So if we return the marker to Aegis 7, it'll stop the outbreak? Exactly. But we need the shuttle to return it to the planet. You have a singularity core. And I can let you through. So what do you say? If it'll end this for good, deal. Excellent. I, I, I can distract Mercer, but not for long. And get the marker to the shuttle bay quickly. Thank you, Mr. Park. For helping me fix my mistake. Nexus Organism. She was only a voice at first, but now she is my constant companion again. I had forgotten how much her presence soothes me. And as always, she sees to the heart of the problem. The marker must be returned. Perhaps there's been some kind of accident, some severance? Do the marker and the hive mind always coordinate? Or can the hive mind slip the marker's influence somehow? Regardless, if this theory is correct, if the two are now at odds, if the marker can quell the hive mind, it would cut the puppeteer's strings at a stroke. It seems obvious in retrospect. These necromorphs have no intelligence. How could they? Yet, there's clear, if rudimentary, purpose behind their actions, especially the gathering of corpses. They're clearly following some drive to kill living organisms and gather biomass. But where does this drive come from? How does it command them? Do all necromorphs, converted by a marker, share this bond? Pack instinct? Or is the hive mind a demonstrating a genuine telepathic communication, perhaps the first ever observed? How painful to admit that the marker's horrors still hold a fascination for me. Now I think I understand my predecessors, those who first studied the black marker, rather better. The road to hell begins with unprincipled curiosity. Foolish, foolish, foolish. I should have known. Sabotaging the engines was only a stopgap. Are we returning to Earth? Is the marker falling back into the church's hands? 
Yes, Amelia. There are always alternate solutions. Always. I'm kind of doubtful that the hive mind and the marker are at odds with each other. And Amelia is obviously not real because they're dead. That's just a vision of the marker. So the marker wants it to be put back on the planet. So that is obviously going to help the marker and probably help the hive mind too. Another one of these absolutely gigantic wine bottles. I guess Kine went into there and somehow completely sealed the door. Okay, we have a couple new weapon upgrades that we've gotten. Flame door upgrade. And force gun upgrade. Don't care about that one, but the flamethrower one I care a lot about. So what does it do? High pressure nozzle, increased range of the flamethrower's primary fire. I think that's the new one? What's the other one? Greatly increased fuel capacity. Yeah. Yeah, the range one is definitely it. Okay, I want that. For sure. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like we we have to get a bunch more capacity. God knows I need more capacity. 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 Now I can get it. And I would like damage as well, so... Yeah, let's get more capacity! Damage from 80 to... 85. Let's spend our final node on the line gun. Let's get capacity. This this weapon actually does need capacity. It seems like the weapons that really need it don't have many capacity nodes, and the weapons that don't need it have a million. I am curious if the flamethrower looks different. Like, is it going to shoot flame noticeably further? Uh, doesn't really look that different. I really can't tell how far it's going, to be honest. Like, is that hitting the wall? I can't tell. Okay, that left a scorch mark. So that hit the wall. Yeah, right there. That's about my range. Yeah, it's pretty decent. I don't know what it was before. Holy lag. I think that's... that's it. Oh, that's not good. Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. Activate loader.
think we're gonna have to move it piece by piece to the shuttle. You have it. Now install the singularity core on the shuttle. I'll come help you load the marker. Damn, Mercer's close. Hurry. Or am I? I'm not sure. Sorry. I think I knocked their arm off. Well, I guess that's the executive shuttle. It's got like a gold front. Wait, is that gold or is that just a window? I think it's just a window. Just kind of gold tinged. And there's a lot of explosives and, and things here. I think we're going to have quite a fight. Ugh. That's where the core goes. I have to say, it's surprisingly um, casual installing the fusion core thing in a ship. I don't know, it seems like it should be harder and require taking some panels off and not just like... Plop. It's in. Singularity core replaced. Test fire shuttle engines to complete hardware installation. Oh, it's you. Oh, fuck you. Oh, I need to burn it in the engines, don't I? Fuck. I'm gonna go for it. Oh, fuck. Fuck off. Oh, yeah, that did it. Hell yeah. Blow you into fucking atoms. Or whatever that was. Oh. We're not done with you, huh? Squeezed, Mercer.
Mr. Clark! Mr. Clark, come in! Oh, fuck this ship. You're alive. Help me. Fuck all men, too. <laughs> I'm here. But every alert on the Ishimura is screaming. Critical damage to internal systems. The marker just ripped right through the ship. Something pulled it down to the cargo bay. Kind. Pilot the shuttle to the hangar. I'm going after the marker. Of course. Amelia, quickly. Wait, Dr. Kine. That guy's lost it. He killed the captain. We can't trust him near the marker. He says returning it to the planet is the only way to end this. We've got to try. I'm heading to cargo. You paint Nicole's rig and tell her where to go. Leave it to me. Thanks. When I get the marker, we're all getting out of here. Yeah, I don't think they believe that. End of day is complete. Alternate solutions, chapter 11. Reach the cargo bay. Mr. Clark, we're approaching the hangar bay. We'll meet you there with the marker. Now we're riding in flight deck, traffic control. Yes, Amelia Sue. We'll send the hive mind back into the darkness. So glad you gave that guy our only escape shot. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, Isaac. Those things you've killed, their biomass has pulled down in the cargo bay. It's recombined itself into... Well, it's something huge, and the marker's embedded right in the middle. How the hell do we do this? I've got the Ishimura's cargo cranes. They can move half a bay of mining gear, no problem. If whatever's down there wants to wrestle for the marker, I'm in. Override the safeties, and yes, it might work. But hurry, we're losing critical systems fast. Now we've got a lot of tools on board a planet cracker. I mean, we can crack a planet. just made that noise. Oh, wow. Wait, did we kill it? We did, yeah. Huh. That was shockingly fast. Oh, yeah. High security garbage can. Security card. Weapon upgrade for the force gun. The lighting just plays so well with these fans. That's a bad noise. Sounds like a deep sea creature. 
Oh. Yeah, let's put that back. Wait, just got an achievement. There's always Peng. Yeah, I just picked up something uh, unique without even thinking about it. An oddly intriguing artifact from the past. Sell at the store for credits. I don't know what, like, is that a reference to something? There's no way to examine the item closer, unfortunately. So what are we doing? Do we need to activate both bridges or something? Um, maybe we need to stasis them? What are we doing? Activate the crane. Oh, I missed this audio log. This is Jacob Temple. I'm being held prisoner by Dr. Mercer. That lying fucker lured me off the mining deck to build something. To make his markers start... converging? I don't know. Liz, if you find this, don't touch that marker. And if you see Mercer, run. I love you. After David, I never imagined... I... Fuck, he's coming back. Time to go, Mr. Temple. You can just leave your force gun here. If you want me to build your shit, I'll need it. But you won't need these modifications, will you? They look like they could hurt someone. I'll hold on to them. There. Now the marker. You can go ahead of me, Mr. Temple. Safety first. Ah, this is what I was missing. Retrieve cargo. Yeah, I'm guessing it's going to get stuck because the bridges are engaged. Oh. Transfer. 
Well, that was satisfying. They're gonna get stuck on the... Oh shit. Oh! Fuck. 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 Oh, this is bad. Oh, fuck. No, I think I just... Yeah. Fuck. Oh, I got so trapped. Okay, pretty much to the tentacle part. Maybe firewalls will protect me? Yeah, I don't even need to stasis the bridges. What will also protect me is not being stuck in that place. Oh, hello. Oh shit. I can't get past them. Please fucking die. Thank you. Don't have much fuel left. I'm expecting more tentacles. Cameras. I I'm just gonna run for it. Wish me luck. 
I think we have a couple of nodes now. Two. Oh yeah, and then schematic gives us an extra one. Maybe let's upgrade the line gun. Laser traps have three targeting lasers, lasers instead of one. That'd be nice. Easier to hit stuff. Plus, I want more damage, so... Yeah, let's get uh, reload. Then the targeting laser thing. Then damage from 250 to 275. I want to see the new targeting lasers. Let's test it out. Oh, yeah. Much, much wider. Emergency. Internal hull breaches detected. Yeah, everybody knows it's not real when it happens to somebody else, but then when it happens to them, they don't. Ah, shit. Well, that was dumb. Oh, that didn't work right. Oh, fuck. That really didn't work right. Sorry, my cat's on my desk in front of my monitor, so it's also hard, just hard to see anything. <laughs> That was a disaster. This 
is the purpose of that thing we were messing with before. Wow. I almost forgot about it. It's been so long. Get this thing over here. I think they repositioned themselves to be in the incorrect orientation. Cause I set these I set these correctly to start with. Oh wait, it even glitched out. Yeah, weird. Oh, uh, but... But yeah, actually... What exactly are we supposed to do? Like, where's... Where actually is the marker? Oh, hello. Look at all this loot. Oh, there's the marker. Something is going to need power. Okay, yeah, so to start with, this actually needs to be the other way. Safeties are still on. I need to restore gravity before we can load it. Hurry! Exiting zero gravity. It's on board. Come, quickly! Go open the hatch for him. Cole, is she 
Aegis 7 was off limits. The planet was one big government experiment. The marker, this divine artifact, it was built by human hands. That's impossible. It's an alien world. The miners dug up the fucking thing. After it was planted here a few hundred years ago. Even Kai didn't pick up on that. They found the first marker in some crater on Earth. That one. That was real. Alien. Enough to inspire you, Natology. Our people studied it and reverse-engineered this red marker. But they needed somewhere to test it. Aegis 7. You've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. I thought the old reports were just hysteria. Until I saw... what I saw. They sealed off the whole system, buried the records nice and clean. Until CEC got greedy. Those idiots tore each of seven apart and woke up with the old research team left behind. So Earth Gulf sent you to sweep it all under the rug. Damn it, we have to return the marker. If anyone else stumbles across each of seven, it was disappeared once. We can do it again. I've seen how the marker fucks with your head, it must be contained. For what it's worth. We made a great team. You'll find another way off the Ishimura. I mean, you're one hell of an engineer. Your experiment's gonna kill us all! Daniels! It was all for nothing. Why try to hide the marker, though? Why not just destroy it? It's Nicole. Where are you? In the flight control room. Please, you have to come up here now. There's still a way out for us, but we don't have much time. Emergency. Deck evacuation protocols are in effect. doing the smart thing. You fucking kidding me? Shit! Warning. Escape pod launch detected from shuttle USG-09. Escape pod. Damn! We lost her. 
It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. But who can? I'll reprogram the shuttle with our flight path to Aegis 7 and join you on board. Don't leave me waiting. Never again. You're about to leave the Ishimura and will not be able to return. Yeah, I think I've done everything I want to do. Let's go. I never doubted you, Isaac. I knew you'd come back for me. Are you ready? Yes. We're together again. This isn't how I imagined say goodbye to the Ashura. You're not ready. The miracle must be as terrifying as a nightmare. The planet is restless, hungry. It'll try to eat us alive. But we have the marker. We'll put things back the way they were. We will be whole again. Chapter 11 completed, Chapter 12, Dead Space. I really like how as we were coming here, Isaac kept having these kind of like blackouts and then they would suddenly be further ahead, like time had passed and they had just lost time. I like that because it's both a way of basically doing a, a cut and skipping time that we don't need, but doing it in a way that's also kind of, I guess you'd say diegetic, like there's an in-universe explanation for why we're actually cutting time, it's because they're having trouble actually like staying conscious and fully aware of what's happening thought that was really cool oh my god look at that that's absolutely epic
there something back there? Nah. The loading track leads directly to the excavation site. It'll work. The hive mind will obey. We'll be whole again. And you and I can be together. Yeah, it needs power. We need to hurry. I know, but no. <laughs> There's secrets. There's secrets to get. I know there's secrets back here. You know, I was thinking that there can't be another level of suit upgrade to get, but I think there actually is. Because last time I was at a workstation thing... Oh, hello. I saw that there were nodes that I uh, couldn't get that weren't revealed for the suit, which means there must be another upgrade level. Because that's how you gain access to more nodes. I love the whistling wind in this crack. This is Sergeant Bram Newman. PSEC evacuation report. The shuttle's gone. Took off and then crashed right back down into the bay. Took a whole crowd with it. Must be a hundred people dead. We've lost the rest of the shuttles. God help us. There's no way out. Anyone hearing this? Do not land. I repeat, do not land on Aegis 7. Fuck the Ishimura. They left us to die. Retrieval order. PCSI retrieval order from Captain Matthias. Retrieved victims of Union Square mass suicide from Aegis 7. Bodies are to be transported to USG Ishimura morgue with security escort. Notify doctors G. Demus and T. Kine upon arrival. Uh, comments. Gabe. Yeah, I know. It's casket duty. But I think you'll like this one. I hear a buddy of yours is down on Aegis 7. Any kitty assignment like this should leave time for a meetup. Don't scare the rookie. Alyssa. I've got four nodes. Let's spend two of them on the contact beam to get capacity. And then most importantly, primary fire damage, because that's the one I use most of the time. From 100 to 125. That's a huge damage increase. 
Let's spend the last two on the line gun. Let's get projectile speed, which I don't really care about, and then this photon energizer greatly increase laser trap damage. So we'll have all of the specials for the line gun, which means I really should use the laser traps more often because they're very powerful now. And they're also just really cool. All right, well, I think that's a good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, I'm gonna make us whole again?